the microscopes work by uh, a tiny little digital camera that can send information to the computer. Uh, it obviously needs to be connected. Uh, we've got a computer connection here. It's connected to a USB 2 port at the back. And all you need to do is just attach this just in the side here. Carefully. And that's ready to go. Uh, now what we're looking at, and it'll be very important later on, is the magnification knob. Um, so you can see this goes all the way up to 4.5 times magnification and all the way down to 0.67. It's important to get this in the right spot. What you can see is a line here on this white outcropping. Uh, and that line indicates that now that's at magnification of 1 times. So the number has to be just above the line. So if we go to 2 times, that's now at 2 times. The other important feature of the scope that you'll see here is this little uh, doodaddy. It flicks between binocular vision uh, and allowing the camera to see through one of the eyepieces. So all the way in, you'll be able to see through both ocular lenses and all the way out allows the video camera to record and you'll get images on the computer. When you're using the microscope it's important uh, to first adjust the eyepieces because your eyes are probably different to the last person that used them. They'll have a different focal length. Now both of these eyepieces are individually focusable but uh, we've also got the video camera on there and the video camera has been uh, put on in such a way that the right eyepiece must be adjusted so the zero is right in the middle with that line. To get this in the, in the right magnification, in the right focus, put your right eye up here, close your left eye and use the focus knob to bring whatever image it is into focus in your right eye. Once that's in focus, you can switch to your left eye, uh, open your left eye and close your right and what you'll need to do is then adjust the eyepiece. Once that's in focus, both of your eyes should be in focus.